All right, guys, welcome to another episode of Dope Talk TV's yeah. Yours Truly Low Key. Got John here with Yo. me, got Jay here with me, got yeah. Ivy in the back. You already know how the fuck we're rocking, man. Hey. We're back with another episode. We're on episode 17, man. We're moving along. Already. Moving along, moving along bro. Uh, you damn. already know how we do it, man. But yeah, um, we're back with another episode for you guys. We got some more content today. And um, Boom. wanted to start off the episode by saying Merry Christmas to everybody. Happy yes. holidays. Shout out to you guys. You know, from our family, Dope Talk family to yours. Oh, uh, yeah. Merry Christmas, man. We... We hope everybody had a, you know, a good Christmas with their family full of happiness Indeed. and all that good stuff. Ate a lot of food. food. Yeah. yeah, good food and all that, man. But, um, but yeah, man, we're back with another episode and, uh. We're we sparking wanted, up. Yeah, we're about to spark up on some good shit, man. I'm smoking on yes, some Gorilla indeed. Glue. What y'all smoking, smoking on, boys? On, um, <laughs> this, my friends, is uh, <laughs> a whole bunch of roaches that I decided to open up. So it's a lot of generations here, a lot of family members. <laughs> a lot of family members. Right? That's yes. a salad right there. Yes, yes, indeed. That's a, That's a variety. What you smoking on, John? Hey man, I'm smoking on some uh, some cherry pie right now. Ooh, Ooh. yeah, but yeah, some man. But yeah, shout out to the single parents, man. That, yeah, that shout actually, out to the yeah. single parents for Facts. real, bro. Speaking of holidays, you're yeah. right. Shout out to yeah, the shout out to parents. everybody that you know that makes it happen. That for made their it happen kids. for their kids, whether they're with or without somebody. But especially the people that are, that don't have that help from their spouse, man, because mm-hmm. that's hard, bro. Making making Christmas happen for your whether kids. whether you're a man or a woman. Yeah, shout out to single parents, period, man, mm-hmm. female. If, if, you know, if you made it happen for years, we salute you for real, yeah. for real, man. Because that ain't easy, bro. That ain't easy. That shit tough. For yeah. real. For real, for real. Not Fact. easy at all. Man, I can't imagine, man. Because, you know, toys are kind of expensive, man. I just realized that, like, this year. Christmas is, man. Bro, you know what is, I think of when I think of. money. I think of a single mom. I seen a picture online the other day. And it made me think. It's a like, shout out to all the single moms. And I thought about it because it showed a lady on a, pl- on a train. Mm. Or a bus, right? And she had like a thing of cupcakes, balloons. She had, she was making it happen for her kid, whatever it was, a birthday. It seemed like, yeah. But it doesn't matter, cause you know how many people's like, man, I ain't about to walk my ass with the fucking cupcakes and get on the train to bring my ass home. Like, nah. But that mom doesn't give a fuck that she has to carry a bucket of ice cream. She's got to carry all this. Remember, she's on a bus. Nobody's there to help her. She's got to carry all those grocery bags, plus the cake, plus everything to make that birthday happen. Exactly. So shout out to all you single mothers, single fathers that are making Christmas Christmas for your children. Yep. We salute you. We salute from Dope you. Talk TV. For real, man. That, it ain't we easy, do. man. It ain't easy. And that's something that's, you know what I mean, it's definitely commendable. Whether Facts. You know, whether you're a guy or a girl, man. Shout out to you guys for sure. But um, But yeah, man. Don't forget to like, subscribe, you know, like the channel, share it with your friends, hit the notification bell, please, man. We're, thumbs we're up, trying to, thumbs up. Yeah, thumbs up, because at a thousand subscribers, we're going to be giving something away, man. We're going to keep telling you guys. So let your friends know, you know, let your family members know. We're going to give away good advice. Yeah. Like, uh, maybe you shouldn't be <laughs> fucking so sensitive in life. Yeah, for real, man. Seriously. Which leads us to our first topic, you know what I mean? <laughs> that John brought up. Dun, dun, yeah, yeah, dun. yeah. It was funny. It was funny, man. <laughs> you know, I really thought it was funny. The, the world's changing, man. You know what true, I mean? True, the world's changing true. every day. And some, you know, some things we don't agree on. And there's some things that, you know, we do agree on. But everybody has their own opinion. Everybody has their own right. And that's okay. To their own opinion. And exactly. that's okay, man. Because I'm not mad. I'm not mad mm-hmm. at some of my friends that have the opposite opinion of me. That's right. I'm, I still love them for who they are. Right. Facts, you know what I mean? Facts. Some people may like a certain person as a president. I may not like him. I'm he's not talking gonna about say, Donald Trump. I'm not going to say no names. Yeah, he's talking about Donald Trump. But it is what it is. Donald Trump. What can Trump. we do? Yeah, but, man. You can um, have different opinions and respect each other, bro. Yo, the real. thing is, we live in the most opinionated generation ever. And the thing is, if I accept your opinion, right, and you have your opinion, like, you might think it's okay to kill people. Mm. Like, to be honest, you might think it's okay to kill people. I don't think it's okay to kill people. Doesn't mean I hate you. Yeah. Right. That's just your point of view. You might think it's okay. Okay, you might agree with death row. Somebody might not agree with death row. Lethal injection. It doesn't mean you know any I mean? of you are wrong. Yeah. It doesn't mean none of you are wrong. It's just your guys' opinions. Yeah, it's all... It, you're... You're looking at it from your perspective. It's all about different perspectives, man. For real, for real. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. We but, gotta agree to disagree. Yeah, exactly. Yep. That, I, I was about to just say that. That was crazy. Like, there's no need. We. Sh- there's no need for people to go into war, shootouts, 
you know, crazy shit over disagreement. Okay, you like gays? That's cool. Some people might not. That's cool. You like brown? That's cool. Some people might not. That's cool. You like yeah. fucking yellow? That's cool. There's people that hate the color yellow. Yeah, because I like black For girls. Real. I yeah. like black girls. Hell you know yeah. what I mean? I have friends that don't. Fact. So what? But the thing is, bro, that's a preference. It doesn't mean... There's a difference between not liking a black person and being a fucking piece of shit racist. You see, that, having that as a preference, like, okay, you don't like, uh, you don't date. That's a preference. You don't, you know, my wife might might like black guys, might like Asian guys, whatever the fuck she likes. It doesn't matter to me. Yeah. It doesn't matter what her preference is. She with me, and I don't care what her preference is. So, like, she might think it's okay. Some other person might be like, oh, well, that's not my option. I wouldn't date a Puerto Rican guy. <laughs> nah, for real, man. Well, I'm not going to judge you, but I do have a question. Whatever happened to Gentleman Dykes? Yeah, facts. <laughs> That's a, yeah. Like seriously, Real what shit. happened to the Steve Jobs Why of Dykes? Like what happened? What happened to that? We ain't gonna judge you, but we need more yeah. Elon Musk type Dykes. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like we need gentlemen. a we need an outstanding man. You Every know, like I know got the trap yeah. popping and the fucking. We already got family. the trap taken care. Of. Like <laughs> like what happened to the become like a fucking scientist or something? I don't know. Like, you never see a. a <laughs> what my man John's trying to say is. If you're gonna be a man, be a gentleman. Be a gentleman. You gotta be a ratchet. You don't dude. gotta be a young MA. There's already a young man MA. You can't Facts, like we already got a young man that's rapping right now. <laughs> that's it. You know, she be snapping. She be snapping. Yo, I fucks with young MA though. Shout out to nah, young MA. Young MA. I yeah, fucks with young MA heavy. Yeah, I do too. That's she got bars. more bars than half the dudes in the game right now. That's like I fucked with young MA heavy. She fucking with the big hitters, man. Shout like, out to young nah, MA. That, that's a good question for real though. Yeah, if you're it's gonna like, be a dude, be a gentleman. That's so true. When you sit back and think about it, I've never met a dyke that's like in a suit with like you know on the way to you know the office or some shit. I don't know. I just feel like they try to be somebody they're not. And you could just see it. And you could see it right through, especially if you're a man. Bro, I had a relative that was out and about with her uh, significant other. And she is a, a lesbian. And um, she was out in the bar and some dude <laughs> tried to hit on her girl. And she approached the guy like a dude would. But the thing is, she looks just like a, you know, she looks just like a man. You know, the man did not know. And he did obviously react like a man's going to when another man steps in his face and he hit her and he knocked her out. And everybody was like obviously upset because it's a female. Which leads me back to the last week's episode when I talked about the whole thing. I did see somebody got offended and commented on the video. And that's okay. Yeah. That's okay because people are going to have opinions. We, we do this that, podcast that, for that people to comment. Us, that leads yeah. us right to our next subject exactly. which is like the double standards. That story that you exactly. just told about the guy hitting the girl or whatever. It's like... There are a lot of double standards when it comes to life, period. Yeah. And I don't know, bro. A lot of these double standards, they're dumb, bro. Like, they just shouldn't be there. But the thing is, like, honest to God, like, doesn't matter if Dwayne Wade's kid wants to be called a she or Dwayne Wade and Gabrielle Union refer to their son as a she. Does it fucking matter? Do some people think it's okay? No. Do some people think it's okay? Yes. Do we give a fuck? No, it's not my fucking kid. It's not my family. It's not your family. It's not going to affect your fucking kid. It's not going to affect your fucking family. If he wants to be called a she or she wants to be called a she, let him. Let him. Let you em. see what? Why does everybody got to get on on this fucking witch hunt? Like, yeah. oh, fuck. Gabrielle Union. Fuck Dwayne Wade. Like, why we got to... Yeah, give a fuck? I mean, I mean yeah. raise your kid yeah. how you want to raise them. Let people do their thing. You That's know the mean? thing. People got too many opinions, and they want to go and tell people, "Oh, be a parent like this." Well, it's also right. so, it's social media too, though. Like, social it's so, media, it's so it's so society, easy nowadays right? to just you know put out your opinion on something yeah. and not be found or 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 just keyboard heroes. You know, yeah, exactly. You know, you got it's fat thumbs. That's what they call mm -hmm. it nowadays. You got the fat thumbs. <laughs> That's real talk, though, bro. You a know, lot of that super fat happens. thumbs. Thank you. A lot of that shit happens way too much, bro. Yeah. For real? Nah, but I can't. I I don't know. Life life is changing, man. People are getting arrested for the most stupidest shit. Yeah, Yo, you know people are saying? getting arrested for hiding logos like this. Check it out. Yeah, look at that. Limited <laughs> edition. Yeah. Facts. Next Halloween. We got toilet paper. The mummy on it. edition on mm -hmm, that bitch. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Listen, for all of you sensitive people, and if you come across this podcast and you're listening right now, and something that we say offends you, look, it's cool to voice your opinion in the comments. I'm going to respond to it and give you my opinion like I did on this show. It doesn't mean I dislike you. It doesn't mean I hate you. It doesn't mean I think that you're less of a person. It's just a debate, you know? Yeah. And if, imagine if everyone in the world 
right? Who disagreed, hated each other. And we're out to kill each other. We live in a fucked up world. There's no privacy. You can't do nothing with your private life. Like, Let's talk about the AB shit. How AB got suspended for having like a personal issue with a female. Ooh. How does that have to do Antonio Brown? Oh, word? Mm. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's uh, talk yeah. about that. He got kicked off the Patriots. One of the best what, running backs in the, in the NFL. You know what I'm saying? And... There's no privacy, bro. I think like, he's like a wide receiver, or, or he's a wide receiver. You get, you know what I mean. I'm not, I'm not really a sports expert, but I know he's a great player. Right. I mean, he yeah. was on top of Madden of twenty, uh, two K nineteen, whatever. Yeah. But he's an upper echelon player for but sure. But yeah, like so what? There was an issue between him and a female, but that had nothing to do with what his performance was on the field. You know what I mean? He wasn't I feel doing like any if drugs. Got nothing to do with your job. Exactly. That's like somebody like that's like you getting fired because you got a DUI. But it's depending on what you but do. That's exactly. A hit, that's a yeah. If you're a truck too, driver, like if you're a truck driver that's and your different. job involves driving, I can see it. Or you're drunk on the job. But it's just like people now, right? You, you might smoke marijuana, but then they're going to drug test you, right? You're not smoking at work, right? The people that go and get shit-faced and act a fucking fool on the weekend don't get, don't get tested for alcohol. They go to work, they're normal because they're not drinking. Who gives a fuck what they do on their personal time? That's, that's what your fact. employer is going to say. Exactly. Okay, fact. so why can't I smoke weed? Oh, my fucking personal time, you piece of shit. Yeah. Why? You see what I'm saying? Yeah. How is that going to affect work if I'm not smoking at work? Exactly. So fuck you to all your employers who drug test. You can suck my dick. No, nah, for Marvel real. Marvelous yeah. J420. Hit me up on Instagram. I'm looking for work. <laughs> Man, it's so... Bro, it's so easy to pass a drug test nowadays. What you mean? Super easy, you know, technology oh, yeah. is advancing every day. We got synthetic... Tests. I got a fake dick. It's black because that was the only one they had. They we, were all sold out at all the yeah. restroom, but it made me look tough. We got, we, got, we, got, probation we got synthetic penises. We got synthetic no, everything. synthetic pee. Synthetic Real poop. penises... Synthetic pee. Everything. Synthetic pisses, he bro, said synthetic crazy. poop. <laughs> <laughs> what you need synthetic poop I for? I don't though? know, bro. To grow something. Mushrooms. <laughs> Fuck. Yo, you can't use human feces <laughs> for shit, though. You can't yeah. use human feces, <laughs> right? Yo, didn't somebody try to grow shit with human feces and, and you can get sick from growing like vegetables My and shit nigga, with human I'm poop. not eating some vegetable that came out of a piece of fucking shit. No, but I mean, <laughs> you, they use like cow manure. That's like real fertilizer, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah but that's... But human poop, people have tried that and I heard it makes you sick. Yeah, because it's not supposed to be in you, bro. That's what comes out of you. Oh, shout out to all my niggas eating shit out there. That's most of you women out there. Like, come me Just kidding. I just kidding. I take that shout out, Shout out Bill Gates for actually making a machine. No, shout out Bill Gates. That was my wife. Shout out Bill Gates. Yo, because he made that. Wife being white? No, that oh. too. But. <laughs> yeah, for real. Shout out white people, man. Yeah, for real. Nah, he nah, made a machine. That. He made a machine that would actually clean, like, actual poop. And make it into like drinking water. How much you trust it? How much you trust no, it? No. no, if they offer you, if they told you, yo, if that gave you this right now, and I was like, nah, this is just me, and my wife, shit. I clean. I ran it through the uh, Bill Gates machine though, y'all. Yeah. No, thank you. Yeah. Nah, it looked clean though. I just, uh, he it, drank. He actually drank it. There was a video of him actually. Man, like, that was some Aquafina. He if I told you, I was like, yo, this is my dookie. Nah. Ah, uh, yeah, but I ran it through the machine. It looks clean. No, no, no. You just don't tell me. Nah. First, <laughs> I'll tell you after. no, no, no. <laughs> Fuck yeah. that. Don't, don't give don't that to wanna. me. He said, don't tell me. <laughs> that don't tell me. Don't give it to me. I'm not trying to drink that if shit. If you're up. playing me, keep oh. it on the low. Yo, oh, who's off for that John's mixtape? Remember that one episode we said he was going to bring one? It's coming soon. This doubles as our like podcast place where we shoot and a recording studio. Yeah, so right. the John's mixtape's coming soon. I got a voice. No answer. Yeah, you do. Do it, bro. Stop me in hey, bed. Hey, whatever. <coughs> You know how to do it. I might get on live a couple times a week. Ooh. Yo, speaking of live, yo, drop some live. Get on yo, the Dope Talk TV. Bro. Even if nobody gets on, because I don't give a fuck. I'm here for entertainment. I'm here because nah, this real. shit's fun to me. Yeah, and if you disagree or agree, you know what I'm saying, go down in the comments and let us know. Yeah. yeah. I don't give a We're fuck. We're inviting to all comments, whether they're, they disagree or agree with us. If right? you agree with us, cool. If you disagree with us, that's cool, too. Yeah. We're here to debate. I will respond. We're on live like right now. Debate. We'll be going on live. We'll, we're connecting. Yeah, we're going to go on live. We're going to do this from time to time. So yeah, check it real, out. Bro. Sorry, bro. I got ass shots and now my booty baked so I can't fit on the seat. Bro, yeah. that that actually, that's a good segue to the next topic, which is... Ass shots. You know, people oh. being entitled yeah. to an opinion. That like, is. You're, everybody's entitled to their own opinion. You know Facts. what I'm saying? Like, Apparently, we're not. Apparently... Yeah, like, People can... No, everybody is, bro. People just get sensitive. Mm. 
people just get sensitive, bro. I'm like, not that sensitive, bro. Your emotions are not, you know, they're not my priority or my control. Yeah. They're not in my control. They're in your control. So, however you feel about a situation is how you feel about it. I'm still going to voice my opinion. I'm not going to do it in a disrespectful way, but, you know what I mean? Yo, I'm not so, Sway joined, bro. What it is, Sway? Oh, oh. Hey. We, got, we got somebody on live with us. <laughs> a whole lot of... Oh, shit. What up? Yo, so, um, where were we on giving our opinions? Yeah, people being entitled to their own opinion. Yeah. I'm entitled to my own opinion. I'll check, it, check this out, right? People think that the lo- you know, that money is the root of all evil, right? I think the love of money is the root of all evil, right? And that's just my opinion. Some people are going to have their opinion. Some people think money is evil. Some people think money is great. Some people think money is a tool. Some people think money makes you happy. I don't give a fuck what <laughs> anybody thinks. That's just my opinion. Opinions are opinions. They're like booty holes. Everybody's got them. Everybody oh, got real, one. Real. And some for are real. dirty and some are clean. Fuck. <laughs> and <laughs> And that's it. Not At the end of the day, we don't give a fuck if you get in our comment section and say shit that you don't agree, because that's cool. You don't have to agree with everything we say. That's a fact. It's beep beep boop beep bop. Bop beep 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 boop. It's good to disagree. Just don't get disrespectful. Just don't be a bitch for about real, it. Just don't be a fucking yeah. bitch. For Seriously. That's the saying out of your fucking vagina. And that's, come on, get on the field. <laughs> yeah, get Walk it off, nah, boys. For real, for real. We're all men here. We're all men here. But yeah, you just gotta, at the end of the day, you gotta agree to disagree, bro. Mm. When something isn't, you know. Talking about a D, agree to disagree, do you agree that sometimes, like, during the holidays, I feel like some crazy fucking depressed ass shit happens? Yeah, that's true. I yeah, feel like Christmas people blues, down. Are people thing, are very bro. depressed. Christmas blues, that's yeah, it. Yeah, Christmas blues, man. Yo, yeah, weren't you saying something earlier about. Yeah, Christmas Eve. Some uh, dude. Shout out, to, shout out to Toby, man. He was telling me, he was sitting in the living shout room to Toby. playing, um, playing video games and shit and he heard a bunch of gunshots and it ended up being that a guy a 65 year old guy killed his 70 or shot his 73 year old sister in front of the cops and they killed him yo what the yeah fuck? Man, that was on christmas eve and there was another incident where like um there That's was like a fa- there was a murder suicide inside of a house with four children in it two adults what? were killed Actually, the mom and the dad were killed by somebody else, and then the, that person shot themselves. Mm. And there was four kids inside the house when it happened. And no, none so, of the kids got hit? No, all the kids were okay, but they're... Uh, n- <laughs> at least that's the plus. Okay is... A, I don't know if you can say PTSD, okay, though, is a bitch. Them yeah, kids man. are going to suffer regardless. For Nobody it, ever it, wins. It usually happens. That, that type of stuff spikes at this time of the year. Like, I don't know why. Suicide yeah, suicide rates spike... You know, because people get down, bro, because you know what? Like when you love people, you have family, you want to give them your everything. Right. But there's so many people that are struggling during the holidays. So many people that are going through bullshit that they can't give their family what they truly would like. And that, you know? not just that. A lot of people are missing from the family, too. And that, too. Like it might be that your first holiday <laughs> without your son that you just lost. Or this is my first just, holiday without my I mean, pops. Then my see, pops passed away saying? recently. Yeah. Yeah, rest in peace to your pops, bro. But that's the type of shit that happens. You know what I'm saying? You can't let a certain situation keep you down. It's okay to grieve. It's okay to cry. But, like, if I stay sad the rest of my life, it ain't going to bring my pops back. It's going to hurt my wife, my kids, me, my friends, everybody. Yep, everything. Yeah. See what I'm saying? So I grieved. Yeah, I cried. Yeah. But at the end of the day, life goes on. And it's not to sound cold, but like it's goes a circle on. of life, too. It is, bro. you know. I'm it's gonna happen g- to me. Yeah, we all have a day to go, man. Exactly. Bro. We all have a day to go, but yeah, the Christmas, Christmas. But that's just crazy. Shooting your sister. You don't like, know what that man was going through yeah, in his true, head. Though. You know that's what I'm true. saying? Like that to shoot your own sister in front of the cops. You you probably not he even was at in the, the end right of the road. state of mind. Yeah, hey, I think. He, like, yeah, like yeah. he wasn't. That's as far as you can go. Seriously. He wasn't that was thinking bad. at all, bro. That's scary. Uh, that was, yeah. Just yeah, like that FedEx driver that got shot. And remember that? Uh, On the news? No, it was in California, I think. And and my uh, brother in law live in California. Shout out to Tito. He's probably not uh, watching was this. Was it FedEx? Yeah, it was UPS. Or it's either something. UPS or FedEx. And the guy was actually like just doing his job. I think it was his first day on, on that route. He got killed? And he ended up being killed on that yeah. day. Yeah. Wait, somebody was that the tried one to that? Hijack yeah, the was that recently? The, yeah, somebody yeah. tried to the hijack diamond the diamond or whatever. And the cops yeah. ended up firing through the like the truck and killing him and and the other guy. Yeah. 
Well, uh, shout out to the cops for being a piece of shit once rest again. Rest in peace. Yeah, rest in peace. Yeah. His that first day. Not even, oh, yeah. No. That was first his day. first day on the job. That's crazy. What are the chances? Think about Terrible. That. Your parents, are, your parents are probably proud of you. Like, oh, my son. You know what I'm saying? Finally, he's driver. got into FedEx. He's been waiting. God bless his heart. Man, bro. Yeah, yeah, that's but that's fucked up, though. But like the somebody's cops resp- shot, though. The cops are responsible for that. Or, like, I think uh, the company said that they weren't going to, that they were going to start a GoFundMe for the, for him. They weren't going to pay for the funeral. Get the fuck out of here. Yep. Bro, you telling me that a company, like, yeah, bro, but, how much is. That tells you right there. That? that tells you right there that the company doesn't care about you. Yo, how much is not just way? that, but honestly, it's the cops, it's the police department's responsibility. They killed yeah, him. That is true. They killed him. It's not the company's fault that somebody tried to rob, yeah, you know, the truck and the cops yeah. killed him in the process. No, nah, it's like, not their fault. Yeah. So I don't sense. know, man. That's the situation, Yo, bro. In in 2018, FedEx reported earnings of 4.5 billion dollars. You telling me they couldn't afford a fucking funeral, FedEx? You couldn't afford a funeral for this fucking guy that got killed on the first day of the job, you fucking pieces of shit. Oh lord, nah, what the funny. fuck? It's not funny, but I wanna tell you I wanna tell you something. That is fucked up. I feel like I feel like just the world is fucked up, man. That is fucked up. They made four billion dollars in one year. But you yeah, guys, pay we're gonna have to apologize to FedEx because it's actually UPS. That, uh... Oh, Jesus! <laughs> you know what? You know what? Yeah, now yeah. I'm gonna have to take it back. Yeah. Yeah. First FedEx, the money, be fall... No, sorry, FedEx. No. But fuck you, UPS. Yeah, yeah fuck yeah, you, UPS. Yeah, you ain't got yeah. no ups. You guys missed the package. No ups yeah, at all. fuck that. John's gonna edit this out. Hopefully, yeah. his editing skills are good. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And, Next time I see a UPS driver delivering some shit, UPS. I'm throwing hands. Fact. UPS. Yeah. I'm throwing the hands, bro. Real talk. Nah, man. No, but to nah, be honest, crazy, bro, bro, that's some that's fucked crazy. up shit. I feel like any company, UPS, whether it be FedEx, whether it be Walmart, whether it be any company, I feel like every major company should offer to bury your significant other. Because do they realize how bro, expensive a funeral is? That's why I tell people all the time. Take care of yourself. When you wake, like, if you wake up that morning and you're like, yo, I really don't feel like going to work and you can afford to take a day off, take your day off to do whatever it is that you enjoy doing because that company don't give a fuck about you. You might go to work and overwork yourself to death, bro, and they won't put a dime into your funeral. Remember? Like, Remember? I said that shit. Yeah. I said facts. that shit for forever, bro. Truth, like, yeah. you gotta take time for yourself, man. Fuck that job. I like, moved here from upstate New York, That job is York, not more bro. important than, take your, risks. than your health, than your kids, than facts. your family. That job is not more important than any of that. Most so. heart attacks happen on Mondays in the morning. So yeah. remember that. Yeah. Did you guys hear about really? the guy? Yeah. The guy that overworked himself to death? Uh, that's a lot of people. That's a I'm bro. A, bro. It's because people want to. Um, what is it? The Joneses. You know, people want to keep up with they the want, Joneses. They want to be the best. Yeah, people want to have the newest car, the newest phone. Bro, look, you know how much I stunt? This is a, um old school phone right here. It looked like a smartphone, but it's like the number seven of this specific phone. They're like, a nun, like the number 11. You think I give a fuck? It does what I need it to do. I swam with this bitch for half an hour. I don't need to keep up with Mr. Jones from next door that has the newest iPhone. You can suck my dick. Yeah, no, for real. That's Mr. true. Jones. It's just like J. Cole when he said there's always going to be a better house or a bigger exactly. or a nicer chain or a nicer car. Like, it's true. Yo, this is real conversation. Like, this ain't like no scripted shit. Nah, like, bro, we just, just sitting here talking bro. our shit. We're smoking, drinking, just, drinking, just, just like y'all would at home. So, for chill real. with us. Come have this mummy beer. Facts. Yeah, for real. And if you like good. what we're doing, please don't forget to like, subscribe, share with your friends. Let your friends and family know. You know what I'm saying? And, and thumbs up, thumbs up. Hit that notification bell, man. Hit that notification bell so you guys are notified every time that we drop something because we drop something weekly. Nah, for and, real. You know what I'm saying? But, but yeah, man. Well, I'm shit. lit, boys. Yeah. I'm fucking lit. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I'm lit. Yo, so how about that giveaway? Let me talk about that. Nobody's commented on what. Yeah, you, like, it's like what y'all don't want free want? shit. Like, don't you guys see fuck? like community yeah. we're events? We're trying to be nice here. Yeah. It's like we're, it's like yeah, somebody like, trying to give their fuck. love away. Nobody you, wants yeah. it. Like what, what the fuck? What do you guys need, man? You I'm know. sure there's somebody out there complaining like me. I wanted fucking uh, fucking earbuds for Christmas. Yeah, and, for and real, like, Claus and get, then fucking leave a comment say you want earbuds for Christmas. Don't be a piece yeah. of shit. Yeah. Don't be a piece of shit. Maybe some Yeezys. It's a simple question. What do you want to see given away? 
You want a gift card with if, money? Say if that. If it was you winning it, what would you want to receive? You know what I'm saying? Like You want $100 on a gift card? Say that. Don't be want, a bitch. Like, come on. Pen? We're all men here. For real. Yeah, for real. But you got to be 18 and up to qualify for yeah, this. If you're not 18 fact. and up, don't waste our fucking time or that's yours. That's a fact. If you're not 18 and up. adult show. Thank you. There's an adult content program. Move if the fuck on. If you guys don't like it. Get the fuck out of here. Nah, yeah, you Straight gotta get out of adults here. Adults only. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't smoke, don't drink. Unless you're 18. No smoke and drink. Yeah, that's as a fact. As much as you fucking want. Th- please yeah. let it be known. We're not condoning nah. underage nothing. Yeah. If smoke you're cigarettes. underage, like go to wife. school, my nigga. Go to school and go home. Go to school. Don't skip. Yeah. I'll tell you what. Because that shit ain't going... I'm telling you, it's going to ruin your life, man. I'm telling you. I'm not going to lie, bro. Uh, I we fucked did it. that up. We did it. <laughs> yeah, we I did, did it. I fucked my whole senior year up. Oh, is that yeah. so? Oh, that's so. Don't be like this fucking guy over Don't here. Be like throw your life guy. away. I mean, I, I <laughs> be like I, this guy and throw I, your I, life I, away. I fucking graduated. I'll tell you that. I walked on stage. I bet you nah, did. You know fact, what I did? You look like the type. I would have beat tried. his ass if that nigga didn't <laughs> walk Yeah, he on told stage. me. He that's good. You want friends like this guy right here. He told me, don't come to my house no more. Facts. <laughs> you can't like, eat If you don't graduate, nigga, no more. He just choked him for 15 seconds. No more. No less. <laughs> no more. No less. Nah, for something real. Light. Something light. Nah. Something light. Bibi the bobby. Woobity woobity. Nah, that's wild, bro. Yeah, I found this chocolate. Shout out to the chocolate makers that made this. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. Ugh. Yeah, Why does it look like real. that? Nah, man. <laughs> yeah, we're going to move on. I hate, I hate chocolate with mint. That's what I hate. Yo, John has a thing against yeah, chocolate with mint. I've been bro, offering him mint for the last shit. two weeks. That's, chocolate with mint is the shit. I you feel like there's just, I don't know, just both of them together, it's just, they shouldn't be together. Thing? Yeah, it's like. It's like pineapples on pizza? Check yeah, this out, it's gummy like ones? pineapples on pizza. So we all agree in this room that pineapples don't belong on pizza? Nah, I fuck with uh, Hawaiian pizza. Oh my, y'all mm. are that couple? God bless America, baby. Y'all are that couple? Oh, Hawaiian pizza and Donald damn. Trump. Damn. The only two things that make I should have known that before y'all invited me over. That's Yo. crazy. <laughs> Yo, Hawaiian pizza, Hawaiian pizza, and Donald Trump are the only things that make this country nah, great. I tried it. It's, that shit's not for me, man. It's, to salty me, it don't sweet. Salty together. and sweet. I feel nah, like nah. I don't That's know. Just, I like pickle juice. Dear Call gross. me weird. I don't you're know if super, anybody. You over here checking you're shit? You're super like, gross. No, I don't know. I like like when I'm done with the pickles, I drink the hates. rest of it. So you suck off the pickles? <laughs> nah, when I'm done. <laughs> Yo, 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 bitch, you gonna wake that motherfucker up? Tell that nigga you don't want no yo, sauce. Yo, yo, the smoke. yo, we're in an apartment right now, and he's yeah. stomping on the goddamn floor like it stomped the yard. Fuck yo, this guy, this is the guy that came in on, on Thanksgiving. <laughs> I remember the bad situation. You could suck a Man, dick. Man, he don't want no sauce. Mm-hmm. You can get the hands. He don't guy. want to just smoke. Subscribe. Subscribe so you for know that. You can get the hands. Nah. And now live, me kicking in his door that's and probably, dragging his bitch ass that's out. That's probably the one guy. That's probably the one guy that's always dumbed down in like the, the videos. Yeah, he he's definitely. Dumbed down. Yeah, he's definitely. You know what I'm saying? It's probably him. Mm-hmm. It sounded like him because he's all crying about shit, trying to prove his point. <laughs> Yo, give me facts. I'm just talking my opinion. I don't give a fuck. Nah, nah man. for real, for real. But I love all people. For real, for except real. you. That's a fact. What's up, you? But yeah, guys, we've we've come to you guys with another episode of Dope Talk TV. Oh yeah, you we know did. What I'm we gave y'all more content once again. Like Random. I said before, like, subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Thumbs up. Thumbs, thumbs up. up. Share. Mommy be and, uh, Hit that notification bell so that yeah. you know when we're coming out. We drop shit weekly, for real, for real. But we, uh, once again, we appreciate everybody. We hope everybody had. A Merry Christmas, a good holiday with their family, mm. yep. full of peace, love, good food, all that good shit. And um, yeah, man. Stay safe, man. We've been back with another one. It's been your truly <laughs> low key. Peace. Bye. We out here. We out this bitch. Sheesh. Bop. Ticky, ticky.